Hey guys, show we here playing more Night in the Woods. We are about to finish the game, I think. Uh, it is getting weirded by the minute, but we killed the bad guys, I think. I think that is what happened in the last part. And we shall check what is going on now. Let's see. And let's look at our computer first. Let's go look at the, um, you know, what people are telling us. Let's start with Angus. Away message. It's good to be alive this morning. That's all. Nice. Hey man. Nice messages last night. I mean like really. You massive dork lol. Band practice today. Because I feel like we need to do something normal. I'm at the Snarkun. Hope you're feeling okay. Sincerely Gregory. Alright so we have band practice today. Hopefully I will not suck at that. Uh, hey May, you okay this morning? I'm not opening the pickaxe today. Greg informs me we are doing band practice though. I'll see you there. Are you sure your dad is gonna be okay with that? I wonder. Is my dad... Oh, this is the epilogue. Nice, so I think we're finishing. But is my dad ever gonna move the freaking boxes? Is my dad ever going to move these boxes? Uh, I wanna go there! What's going on? How do I make my dad remove the freaking boxes? Maybe I missed something in the game. May, honey, is that you? Yeah. I'm back in the kitchen, if you want to talk. Sure. Hey, mom. Hey sweetie. Hey mom. How are you feeling? Good enough to jump up here. Can you do me a favor and stay home tonight? Why? It's been... I just... I... You're an adult. And you can do whatever you want. But you do live here. And you are still my baby. Aw mom. We need to come up with some ground rules. Just because. Honey, you could have died the other night. I could have, indeed. And then you just left to hang out with your friends. I... I... I'm so sorry, mom. Sweetie, what's going on with you? Uh... I don't even know if I can tell you. Why? I'll understand, I promise. I don't even know how to talk about it yet, I don't think. What happened at school, hon? I don't care what it is. Please just tell me. Are you working today? No, me and your father are both off today. I'll be around tonight. We can talk about it then. Sure. Uh, we can make breakfast for dinner like we used to. That can flip the pancakes in the air. Sure. Alright, uh, that's nice. So the epilogue is going to involve a lot of talking. Are you going out today? Yep. Can you please stay in town? Yeah, ma'am. I think they're getting some of the longest night decorations out. Oh wow, calling for some snow too. That went fast. What did? The fall. Always does, Han. Okay. Well, I'm off. I love you, sweetie. I love you too, mom. Can we talk again? Are you still reading the same book? Oh no, this is a different one. This one's about people who died in the mines around here. Oh cool. Yeah, it's very interesting. Uh, it's got some old songs. Wanna hear one? Sure. Far from here, the ocean's roaring. Far away across the din. I hear the Laura call their children. Bringing in, bringing in. I'll see you walking through the barley. We'll find each other, friend and kin. I hear a Laura call their children. Bring them in, bring them in. Tarry with me a mo for a moment. Talk to the places we have been. The Lord will call us both to heaven. Bring me in, bring me in. Um, I think that the poems of the kid are better. It is, it is nice. Alright, uh, I'm gonna leave now. Where's my dad though? <sighs> will he ever move the boxes? Um, I wonder.
Hmm, do you think that kid has a last poem? Oh, that's that. Hey, Dad. No work today. I told Bob to shove it. Really? No. You okay? Yeah, I'll be fine. Not gonna uh, sugarcoat it. I hate my job. Oh, Dad, why? I've mined, I've made glass, I've done a heap other stuff. But this place, they just don't respect you for working. They don't? Job's supposed to pay you enough to live. Job's supposed to let you provide for your family. Job's supposed to have regular hours. Bob's supposed to respect you. Workers supposed to be able to talk. Workers supposed to be able to have a life. Workers supposed to be able to live. Your mom always had to work, but I wanted to give you and her uh, your time. I wanted her to have hobbies and enough time and money to do them. That's what made me happy. Now I just work so I keep our health insurance and hold on to the house to try to at least. Is there anything you can do? I mean, we do need a union. It's just easier to say it than to get it done. Unions are always there in the mines and the factory, at least for a while, but here. Listen, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be around tonight for dinner. Whoa, what's the occasion? Well, mom said we could make breakfast. Oh, sounds good. Uh, I was gonna talk about some stuff, okay. Maybe we can talk about your stuff too? Just one big staff union. Uh, staff session, sorry. That sounds uh, great, kitten. Love you, dad. Love you too. Uh, be back later. Can you move the boxes? Um, he's getting an early start on the longest night lights plan. Gotta dig them out of the closet. See if they even work. Can I help put them up? We'll see. You're a small fry. Dad. Do do do. Do do do. Okay. He's never gonna move the boxes. I, I am getting used to it. It's never gonna happen. Uh, hey you. Do you have a poem today? Hey May. Sub sellers. You okay? After the whole head injury thing. I'm alright. Headache is all. Um... Can I... If you ever take pills that make you pee, is the caffeine. Oh, I didn't know that. Used to work at the pharmacy. Alright. Oh, uh, if I ever have a headache or need to pee, I'll come by. Anytime, neighbor. No more points today, huh? Uh, it's... What's up, dude? It's not coming. Gonna be bad this year. Okay. It's... Okay, the guy's up. Let's go. Hey, hey, hey. Pick me up. Hey. Alright, uh, let's go this way. Um, yep, this way. Yep, can I make it? One, two, three. No, okay, that's not the way. I have to actually go all the way to the left. I mean, not all the way. This way. No. Oh, what am I doing? Why is this not working? Okay, good. Sub Doc. Hey, May. Hey, Mr. Uh, Chasokov. Got any more dust stars we can look at? More? One more. Okay. Ah, my blind! This is your own fault at this point, I would say. The star is so close. This one? No, this one. Can I... I can't figure this out. Try again. Oh, another one. Is this one? Yep. Found it. Let us consult the guide. That's the guy with fire, the fire maker. A wanderer in the cold and dark, making a fire and hungling up to it for light and warmth. Sounds festive. Sounds like survival. Huh. This star makes me want to cry. Crying on my roof? Do you wish to talk about it? 
No, it's fine. Uh, is it a happy cry or a sad cry? I don't know. I don't have great words for it. It is okay. Sometimes too many words. Yeah. Thanks. You. Thank you for this. Thank you for joining me. Okay, that was it with the stars. So what now? Super moon is coming. What is that? A giant moon. Whoa, that sounds super. Uh, you must come meet me when it happens. Uh, it will be uh, late at night. There will be others on the roofs. You can come, I will make hot chocolate. What a time. Sounds great. I want to see a super moon. Plan on it. Uh, see you later, Mr. Chasakov. See you later, Stargazer. Uh, maybe that could be my, my, my nickname. Uh, May the Kitten Stargazer. Let's go. Am I gonna fall? Am I gonna fall? On the next map? Uh, nope. Alright, let's go. Okay. This guy's dead, so sorry for him. Or girl, I guess, Casey Hartley. Uh, I'm gonna go talk to Bruce to see what he's up to. Then to Germ, he probably has some information. And then let's do the band practice, I think. I think that is a very good routine for our uh, plane. Uh, although Bruce did disappear, didn't he? Was he... did he die? Did they kill him? Maybe. Hey. Hey there, May. What are you doing? Just cleaning up. Do you know where Bruce went? I don't know, May. I wish I did. You need some help cleaning up this place. That'd be nice, May. There's a wreck back in the shed behind the church. Oh, I can't do it now, but... <laughs> Run along, May. Damn. Like, I mean... Yeah, I guess I cannot do it now. I have to go to the band practice. I was expecting this game to be um, more linear. To be like just one night in the woods with a lot of weird stuff happening and to be way shorter, I think. I was expecting this game to be like three hours of one night uh, in, in which strange things happen. But it's been going along many days and it's telling a full story. So uh, I'm really liking it. It's very, it's very good. Definitely would recommend it. Uh, wait. This wasn't supposed to be open. It says open. Should be say, oh, this guy. Hey, it's you. Yep. For now, at least. You know, I've never got your name. I'm the janitor. He has no name. He's the spirit of the forest. I clean up. I do fix it. Whatever needs done. Oh, okay. So, what's feeling like being home again? Things like you remember them? Uh, no. I don't know. I don't even remember today. Huh? Mm, sounds like you've been going through something. Uh, how did you know? Call it experience. I swear some mornings I feel every bit as old as these trees. You know, something big did happen. And I feel like I should have woken up today. And like have learned something. But I don't know if I learned anything, really. Well... In my experience, the big things don't teach you anything. But they make you something. And sometimes you gotta wait a while and see what comes of it. Huh. Well, done an honest day of work. Quit in time. Smelt, uh, smelt us game tonight. See you around. Not if you see you first, May. Haha. <laughs> Weez. The squirrels are very athletic in this game. 
Uh, how do you know my name? Chan. Also, also this place is called Possum Springs and I haven't seen one single possum. All these squirrels. And pigeons. Holy crap. Uh... Ah! Uh, a taco place! This is the best thing that's happened to this town since... They got rid of all those snakes in the diner. They got rid of all those snakes in the diner. The owners were religious, and they call in a preacher from one of those holiness camps up the hills, and he got in there and yelled at the snakes to leave. The next day after he died, they just set traps. <laughs> that's quite nice. Nobody knows where they came from, or why they moved in. Uh, but they got God. Life moves on. Oh my God! They deliver. I'm gonna eat this shit out of some tacos. All right. Oh, this guy. What's up? So you're a taco dude now. I mean, I was hired to be a tacos artisan. But I guess that means holding this sign out in the snow. It's not really snowing that hard. It's just snowing. There is a snow in the sky, falling. How are the tacos here? Good, I like tacos. There is not the person on God's earth who doesn't like tacos. Bad news, my ex hates tacos. Who's your ex? Uh, they are now your ex. <laughs> uh, have fun with the tacos. Eat pace. Wanna talk again? Taco pack. Dine, dine out. We deliver. Please tip your delivery persons. Uh, best tacos in all this general region, pretty sure. Being missing the pizza place? Why not try a pizza taco? Oh wow, that sounds amazing. Watching your health? Try out the all lettuce taco. That sounds horrible. That sounds horrible. All lettuce taco. Who would do that? Why would you inflict that up on the world? No, no, I didn't mean to. Uh, is this gonna be a cutscene? No. Uh, I need to go see Germ before starting the band practice. Hopefully I will not suck that hard in this band practice. I'm gonna use my two hands. This guy, I keep seeing him today. I haven't seen him before, I think. Uh, I wonder if Germ did use dynamite. Maybe he will tell me. And he's not here. Alright. Nothing to do except for band practice, I guess. Well, this is the last chance not to suck at band practice. Oh, look who's alive and well. Is that a surprise? Nah, just seems like re relevant. Uh, look who's alive and well, you two. What? Can we do band practice? You wanna get out of here? Do band practice? Yes, let's do that. Okay, guys, wish me luck in this. Okay, this scene of getting in hasn't been done before. Uh, God, this store just does not like to open. Bet it's worse in the summer. So, did you all get keys to the back door? Greg got one and we made copies. How'd he even get a key? I have no idea. Where's Greg? Oh yeah, he had uh, to spring Angus from work. Uh, what does that mean? Zero clue. Huh. I'm a little unclear about how both of them still have jobs, since they seem to just uh, up and leave work early a lot. 
There's a lot about those two I don't understand. I think they just plain uh, need each other. Greg more than Angus, I think. I don't think Angus will agree. That's because it wouldn't occur to Angus to think otherwise. Because Angus is an extremely nice person. Uh, Greg's a nice person? Do you not think they'll last or something? I mean, they're high school sweethearts. Once they move and change and meet new people and become new people, I think Angus is gonna find he's got more options. Angus thinks Greg, like, saved him. Listen, I'm not saying he didn't, but uh, if you think so, Angus might also just be attracted to really sincere guys in leather jackets who carry knives. I mean, if I met uh, the right guy, those would be pluses. Jeez, you've thought this out before you came back. They were the only people I hang out with most of the time. I've had a lot of time to study. So, like, how are you? says Bea. Um, I don't even know. I'm still processing. I'm here, though. Yeah, you? Not great? I had a dream the world was ending. Might be. Do you think we're safe? No idea. Great feelings. Yep. So, like, I'm a little confused about what even happened last night. Um... Well, there's apparently a death cult of dads, or was. Who knows if that was all of them. I can't believe they even exist, or existed. Probably take them a few days to die. Yup, that's a horrible thought. I don't know, I can't understand them in a weird way. Really? It's like a porch light that's on, and there are all these bugs around it, and then the light goes out. And there's a hole where the light was. It's like what happened to me way back. Like I was telling you about on the couch last night. Uh, holy crap that was last night. Seems like two lifetimes ago. Yep, two lifetimes ago. The world is extremely bad. Yes, yes it is. Weird question. How do you like get up every day what how do you like get up every day and go open the store and keep doing it um, I really have a choice I don't really have a choice do I um, uh, you do though you don't give yourself enough credit you keep all this running because you care I guess caring doesn't always seem to be voluntary caring can be really terrifying I feel like it's always there, right out of sight, following me. I can't not give a shit. I mean, I do the store and our bills at home. The stuff with the Chamber of Commerce. I'm doing free study courses online. And I'm a member of the Young Socialists. So she works as a capitalist and then she's a socialist. I sleep a lot and sometimes eat pizza. Twitch according to their ability. Well, <laughs> that's so funny. Uh, on the bright side, you got me. <laughs> yeah. We can fix the world together. Yep, fix it right up. I guess last night wasn't so weird. It was pretty weird. All men killing the young and the poor to get back some past they barely existed. Same old, same old. They are like ghosts in some old mansion, killing the new owners. Makes you want to either give up or try harder. Or get really upset and take a nap. Yeah, naps fix everything. Or like drop an elevator on them. You drop a m freaking cave on them, basically. So, how good is your car? Good how? Like, can it drive real far? May, do you know anything about... What? We should, like, do a road trip. To where? Out west. It gets all flat. It... Uh, that it does. We can go where it's really flat. And they sell barbecue. 
and you can see the world star just Pierre Oggy. Or a museum of toy rocket ships. Or a factory where they make pretzels. Or a hot that looks like a big chicken. I could. Okay, let's talk about it next year. I'll start planning it now. I thought you couldn't leave home because of your issue? Uh, you're home enough. I mean, if we're trapped here together, we might as well be trapped out there together. I mean, if you are not dead by then, lol. You have a way of making Doom sound like a lot of fun, Mayday. Uh, that is actually kind of a gift. God damn these doors, says Greg. I think God already has. Uh, there they are. Hey guys. Sap nerds. Psst, it's you who are the nerds. How do, I, I am not, I am more interested in knowing this than insulting them. I made up a family emergency. My uncle got run over by a tractor. Hahaha! <laughs> wow. I mean, he did in real life too, but that was years ago. Hey Greg, so... I didn't really know Casey. Huh? Yeah. I just wanted to say I'm really sorry. Yeah, thanks. Casey was a good one. Casey was good. Uh, should we like, tell his parents? Probably. What do we tell them? I don't know. We Can we like, make up something that sounds real or what the truth isn't real enough now you're right the truth is insane so like what do we do about Casey no like in general can we build a factory for pretzels uh, can we think about this tomorrow can we just play song and get a pizza I don't think song and pizza are an answer really can we just be normal for like one day? I don't know how today can possibly feel normal. When I was down there last night, I like made the decision not to die. Or at least not to die without a fight. And the thing down there told me nothing would save me forever. Wait, it was like talking to you? It's been talking to me for a long time. I just didn't know what it was. But anyway, like, nothing is gonna save us forever. But a lot of things can save us today. That's really pretty, May. Thanks, I totally made it up. Like, right on the spot last night. I said it before, you're good with doom. Doom doom doom! So anyway, song and pizza. We earned it by still being alive for another day. That's a decent reason. Decent. Decent. Can we play? Decent. I want, they're gonna say decent again. Whoa! I didn't get a chance to play the guitar again! Or the bass. Well guys. I think that was a commentary on the game. It was... Decent, I guess. Uh, the music was by Alec Holofuka. Um, thank you for watching. This was a nice series. Uh, it was a bit longer, a bit weirder than I thought. And now I shall Google whether my dad is ever going to freaking take the boxes out of the freaking room. Uh, that has me kind of bothered. I didn't know how to make him do it. Uh, Alright guys, thank you for watching. Please check my other content, I have a lot of games I'm playing or that I mean to play and leave a comment so you, I can know what you want me to play, if anyone is watching. Um, Alright, see you next time, goodbye!